Hey folks, it's me again. It's uh, <laughs> well, y'all know who it is, right? This old fat rat, salted shell back, all that, you know. Hey, your buddy, right out here in California. Well, we out here. Look at this. Look at that beautiful view out there. Look at that beautiful. Oh man, this is incredible. We, we, I come up on shore for a little while here. Got to take the dog and let him do his thing. You know, and you gotta, gotta empty that that uh, back end too once in a while. And uh, he's over there doing it. As they say, he's over there, wandering, wandering around, checking things out, getting ready to empty his loads. But anyway, just wanted to say, hey, uh, you know, we got an update. We're doing pretty good here. Uh, just that's about as far as my arm will reach, eh? But uh, there you go. Uh, we're out here. Oh, look at this. This is the kind of view we get out here. We get to see this kind of thing. Look at that beautiful car over there. Ooh, look at you, man. And there's all kind of pretty things out here. It's a beautiful day. Beautiful day in the neighborhood. But uh, we just got done rowing in about 700 yards from my boat. Way out there. You, can, you can't see it on this. They're putting a new piling in from one of the other uh, people who lives out here on the docks. And they got their channel kind of blocked off right now to get in, but I can get around it, it's no worries. But anyway, just want to say hi and happy boating and token. Uh, living the life, viviendos la vida. Viviendos el sueño, living the dream. And when you're living the life and you're living the dream, you got it all, man. If you ain't got that, you need to get what your dream, man. Figure out what your dream is, man. What makes you gonna be happy? And work for it, man. Put some, put a goal there, man. You gotta have something. Unfortunately, your goals change as life passes. I mean, you know, when I want, when I was a young man, oh yeah, I was like, oh, I want all this. I want to have this. I want to have that. I want to, you know. But then as time passed. And I realized that once I had a family and they all had moved out, I might have a five bedroom house, but I ain't been using but one bedroom. Or maybe two, depending on if your old lady's a real, you know, doesn't want to sleep with you no more or whatever. But anyway, but the bottom line is, is you don't need a five bedroom house when you're old. You just need a little two bedroom house. So why you want to have all these fancy house, huge monsters, monsters, you, you don't need that. All you need is enough. And if people would settle for enough and didn't have to have everything, just enough is all that matters. Enough. Enough food, enough shelter, enough clothing, enough love. Love in the world. There ain't enough love in the world. You got to give love to everybody. Love everyone. Even if you tell them, fuck you, that means you love you. Because you can't love somebody without telling them that. Anyway. But anyway, that's how it is. But like I said, folks, God loves us. We love the world. If we treat this world right, it'll treat us back. But if we crap on it, damn, I hate to say what's going to happen. Martin Words, love your neighbor. Treat him as you would yourself. Which means, think about it. Respect for others. Respect for self. Responsible for what you do. Three R's. Never forget them. Godspeed. God bless.